So I guess I'd become what they wanted me to be. A killer. Some rent-a-clown with a gun who puts holes in other bad guys. Well, that's what they had paid for, so in the end, that's what they got. Say what you want about Americans, but we understand capitalism. You buy yourself a product and you get what you pay for. And these chumps had paid for some angry gringo without the sensibilities to know right from wrong. Here I was, about to execute this poor bastard like some dime store angel of death. And I realized they were correct. I wouldn't know right from wrong if one of them was helping the poor and the other was banging my sister. I'd arrived in Sao Paulo a few weeks before. I was working a protection detail for the kind of people who need protection in a town like this. And what kind of town was this? One where I didn't speak the language and they didn't water down their drinks. So for now, we seemed to get along just fine. Of course, that was about to change. Hey, brother. Hey. How's the cocktail? It's scotch. I never mix my drinks. Well, at least not on duty. Something like that. Man, that favela is big. Yep. Nothing like the view of extreme poverty to make a penthouse cocktail party really swing. I guess they call it trickle-down economics. <laughs> That's funny. It's supposed to be a charity thing. Drink and give money. I don't know. Something for the kids. Hey, listen, man. We better look lively. This place is a nightmare. They just got cowboys running security downstairs. Something rotten in the air. That didn't mean much. There was always something rotten in the air. The family we were protecting were local celebrities, rich parasites with delusions of humanity. The kind of people who end up in glossy magazines or body bags, depending on how their luck runs. So where are they all? I see Rodrigo over there talking to that guy. Yeah, I don't know him. That guy next to him. He's some kind of cop. Uh, I think, I'm not sure. Serious though. Big end cop, anti-gang sort of thing. I can't remember his name. Who's this guy? That guy's a plastic surgeon or some kind of surgeon. Uh, tummy tucks and cock implants. Ha! <laughs> Look at Marcel. Still dances like a fool. Guess that's what a European education and a coke habit will do for Ricky Martin look alike. <laughs> that's very funny, Max. Oh, excuse me. I was mostly working for Rodrigo Branco, a local businessman. Built things, did some charity, had things named after him, won awards, owned things, people. One of the trophies he had won was his wife, Fabiana. She was hot and wanted to be dangerous. Some good genes trying to fight their way out of a cesspit. She'd married well and was now at leisure to regret her good fortune. They got along as well as any rich workaholic and his younger airhead wife tend to get along. They mostly ignored each other. She spent a lot of time with his cokehead younger brother, Marcello. He was a good time guy, if your idea of a good time was an expensive suit, a bottle of champagne, and nothing between the ears. The middle brother, Victor, had just walked in. He was a local politician. Guy was smoother than an oil slick on an iceberg and about as toxic. The rest of the crowd, I didn't know, but I could imagine the types. People who know if they drink enough, they won't have to feel guilty about their good fortune. Suddenly, things turned real ugly. Felt like our hangovers arrived right on cue. Pass off! What was that? I don't know what the fuck that was. Let's go. Things had gone Shit. from fine to fucked up in about a second. And now there were two idiots at the wheel. Clear. Got this floor? Sure. Right, look after yourself, bro. Stay safe. It wasn't my own safety I was concerned about. Trophy wife or not. 
I'd said I would protect the girl. I hoped I hadn't lost my edge, along with everything else. It was time to choose, a nasty fall or a bullet to the head. Hello everybody and welcome to watch another of my gameplay walkthroughs. This is FM's 19th YouTube channel and you are watching Max Payne 3, the gameplay commentary. This is the first episode and I'm now pitching in after the story has just begun and we are here in the action. Okay, I'm just getting to know with the controls here. Shooting in style. And that was the boss see, lady. Only this time she wasn't calling for more vodka in her Cosmo. Alright, just randomly trying to get somewhere. I hope this is the place. Alright, seems to be. She's in trouble. What are the odds? Might have been stupidity, or drunkenness, or maybe both. But before I knew it, I was back taking insane risks, trying to save fallen women. All right. Time to put the pedal to the middle. Slow mo, kill cow, and into the pool. Tranquila, tranquila. Nós cuidamos disso. Nice work. Now you need a hand? No, you. Who the hell's Rodrigo? I don't know, man. Thanks. Somebody's gotta go find him. Está tudo sob controle agora. Fica tranquilo. And here we go. Saving the boss, man. The employer. I imagine the elevator doors opening to a firing squad of muzzles. As far as I could see it, the one thing my plan had going was that no one else would be stupid enough to pull this move. Bronco! What have you done with him? Yes, this this is just my luck. Luckily I have two of those painkillers left, so okay, crouching is not good. Am I dying here? Okay, some of the painkillers and all the pain comes away. I had away. to keep moving. I didn't want to fuck this up more than I already had. Better sneak around. Better to be safe, safe then. Alright. <laughs> Shit. Let's see. Alright, here we go. A couple of headshots to seal the deal. As you can see, he has some kind of rifle. Guess I wanna pick that one up for some firepower. Don't know just yet if I can use this, but we shall see. It looked like they were taking him out through the basement. Maybe I still had a shot. Rodrigo was too rich a prize for them to throw away. Sure, I'd have to work hard to get him back, but I knew the bad guys would want the boss alive almost as much as I did. All right, there are some more of those guys. Pretty sure I'm gonna die soon. Since I'm just trying to get to know this game. Well, it, it happens. Alright. They go way easy down. In my opinion. The control box was on the wall to the left of the gate. Let's move on. Alright. Seems to be the quick turn control. Search for clues. Okay. We 
we are searching. Doing the best we can. Them, I say so. I had to move. Yeah, yeah. I know, I know. But they said I gotta look for clues, so I'm looking for clues. This way. Some gun. What's that on the ground? The great thing about being famous as well as rich is the bad guys know who to kidnap. Okay, let's grab the gun. Oh shit. Seems to be. Okay. You can't pick the gun since it's next to the picture, so let's forget about that one for a while. Another parking lot rattling with gunfire. Was I too late? Right. Dual wielding some of them pistols. Ah! Oh. Shoot them! Shoot them! Bullet time! Bullet time! Using some force. They still think they can get away, but there's no chance. Shoot the tires. Go for the tires. Just like that. Couple more guys left. Stay down, Mr. Bronco! They're dead. Okay, this is my final breath. Ah, dead. Well, it's a do or die situation, so let's try to take this one again. Now that we are a bit healthier, we won't be doing the same mistakes again. Okay, one left, one left. Oh. Up down. Ooh, torn. It's from Brazilian. Everything is okay. Soccer T-shirt. Guess. Oh shit. There's more. And one just there. Oh, hit it. You're okay. You're okay. Yeah. Okay, so far I have to say that the gameplay feels a bit sluggish. I don't have any aim assist, so it's gonna be hard. It's okay. Hard to get the, some of those shots at the target, but let's just take this scene. Um, then we're gonna be out for this time, and I'll be posting next episode pretty soon after this one. Yay, they speak in Portuguese, and I guess I understand some of that, since I know some Spanish, it's not that much different, Brazilian Portuguese, but that's something anyway, and... Hey, what could be better, huh? The good guys are reunited, and the Commando Sombra are dead. Yes. Yeah, that's storytelling for you. I don't know. Some kind of cop. Different branch of the police. Not Ufid, but uh, normal cops. I don't know about this. Alright. Yeah, thanks for watching. And Shit, tune in for the next episode up. as well. See you. Bye.